It's always fun exploring a new lake, but you gotta have patience. Out early again in Grand Rapids today, looking for whatever wants to bite. Let's go get them. All right, dealing with a little wind this morning. Let's use it to our advantage and see what our maps can spin up. All right, you know me, I like to use the top water bait. And since we got a little bit of wind, we are sitting on top of a point that extends out and there's deep water on both sides. I'm gonna use the skitter walk because it's kind of bulky and it's loud and we'll see if anything is kind of feeding on top of this and an arm sticking out. I told up the side. That would be fun if their smallies are up here. Fish on. All right, we're on the board. There we go. Fish on again. Well, I think I just saw his slightly bigger brother. <laughs> there we go. What we got? Uh, another species? Largemouth. All right. Nice perch. <laughs> Hard to hold. Nine inch perch, not bad. Oh, 
All right. It's always good when you get the net off for a perch. All right. Finding some big perch today. That's kind of cool. Let's see what we got on this one. That's 11 and a quarter inch perch. Nice fish. Most of the lakes that I fish in have tiny perch, so it's kind of cool to see some bigger ones. Tried lots of things. Tried the frog, of course. Tried some other top waters. Tried the MEP spinner, crankbait, and in the end, it was a yellow power bait that really got the fish fired up. Now, it wasn't what I planned it on going for, but you know what? Whatever's biting, that's what you go for. And I ended up getting into some really nice perch today. Thanks so much for watching this video. If you like what you see, subscribe.